Hello everyone, welcome to TS Info YouTube channel. This is Chandrika from TS Info Technologies. In the previous video, I have explained on how to add a link in SharePoint Online Document Library. In this video tutorial, I will explain you how to add a link to a document in classic SharePoint Document Library. To implement that, open your SharePoint site with your Microsoft credentials. Here I have opened one of my SharePoint site. In that, I have selected one of my document library that is online training on Power Platforms. To open the classic version of SharePoint site, we have to click on return to classic SharePoint version. For that, we can find return to classic SharePoint on the left navigation and also we can find when we click on the site contents. It will appear return to classic SharePoint version. So click on the return to classic SharePoint. Then it will open the classic version of a SharePoint site. Here I was selecting this document library online training on power platforms. In the classic version of a SharePoint online site document. In the document library, we can find the library here. Click on the library on the top of the page. After that, select the library settings. We cannot find content type section in the library settings page. For that, we have to enable allow management of content types. For that, select advanced settings that is present under general settings. Click on advanced settings. In the content types, we can see it has been selected as no in allow management of content types. Enable that option to S and scroll down the page and click on OK. Now in the library settings of a document library, we can visible that content type section in the library settings page. Then click on add from existing content types. Add link to a document and click on add. Then it will add to the content types to add box and click on OK. After that, come back to the document library. This is the document library I have shown previously. Then click on the files tab here. Then it will open the options. Under the files tab, click on the new document. Then it will open two options like document and link to a document. When we select link to a document, then it will open new link to a document. Here in the document name, we have to provide the name for it and the document URL. For providing the document URL, I was selecting one of my list URL. For that, I was going back to my list. I was copying the URL here. I was pasting the link that I have copied previously and providing the document name as Ali Branches. Now you can see a link has been added in the document library in a classic SharePoint version. When I click on this Ali Bank Branches, then it will navigate to the Ali Bank Branches that is present in my SharePoint site. This is how to add link to a document in SharePoint classic document library. For more videos on SharePoint Online, please like, share and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you.